Good morning, everybody. We're pumping again. We're down on the ocean again. We've got a pretty big house. A lot of ledge in this one. Wait till you see this. So we're just trying to get as much concrete floor inside the foundation as possible. So he'll have some kind of a basement. It's pretty tight down here too. Not much room for everybody. I believe there's too many spots left down here on the ocean to build on after all these years, but people find the craziest spots. So there's all the ledge inside. We're going to try to get as much of this flat as we can. He's got a pretty good area there we can get flat. A little bit up front here we can get flat. We're going to put a little concrete there and just kind of float it out, but we're not going to try to get any on that steep rock. First truck's got ten and a half yards, so we're expecting him to at least get this this big square area done. And then we got ten and a half coming on the second. We're hoping he's gonna finish this. When it's so out of level, it's kinda of hard to figure the concrete obviously, but we're gonna do the best we can with what we got here. And you did. After I went in and did all the edges and then I floated it. Then I went back and did the edges. He grabbed the machine. That's exactly how it went. I got it right here. Want it? It's got to be the right slump to be able to darby it. I just want to be able to get a pad so we don't get it too high right there. Give it another drink if it needs it. Tell Scott. I give it ten more. So this this sub base is really out of level. I mean, this stone, this rock came right down here. So they they just kind of put the crushed rock over. So the floor, you know, we're gonna match the top of the concrete wall there, the bottom of that sill plate. But it because of the ledge under this stone, the floor is gonna slightly slope up this way, just so we can get get some coverage over here and at least get them a, a concrete floor in here. But it's not gonna be perfectly level all the way across. Won't be bad, it'd be about an inch and a half higher over here than it's going to be over there. How bad? It's gonna slope from there to there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Not no pads down here, no nothing different. So. It's a little bit higher, yeah. Yeah, we might want to just in case. Hate to drag too much out. Level that, I'll get another one right there.
You okay, Luke? Yeah. Couple more feet. Good. Come down to where we're at, Danny, and we'll mag a little more. You okay? You good? Go a little bit more. Looks really high. That looks really high. Slow and steady. Do you even know that speed? A little bit. <laughs> I doubt it. I think we're good here, yeah? Just drag a little bit out, we'll fill it in over there. I'll go another foot or so, then we'll just come out, either Darby in it or whatever. He's got, let's do the flat pie. Yep. And then we'll just walk him back here and just Mag our way back out after. Okay. Should be all right, huh? Yeah. Do we got a smaller one out? No, I can grab. One. We got an eight, but that's on. Yeah. You want a tall one, Mike? Yeah, it'd be easier than dragging this way over there. I think. Yeah. Who we got? Relatively old, not compared to us, but... I am. Oh, he is too, huh? It'll be a three, even though you told him a seven. It'll be a three. Okay. Trust me. He can drive a truck okay, but he's still working on the slump thing. Oh, should I go up and look at it? Probably, right? I can't do it if you like. Nah, I'll do it. You just take it easy. That's I've not your job. <laughs> Close. I think I'd still give it a little more. 15. Usually, usually the time it gets out the end of the hose, it feels a little stiffer. We'll just see how it feels like then let you know. Alright, so we got this section relatively flat, you know, kind of flat in here. It does slope up towards that back wall a little bit, and then it slopes up a little bit more towards that rock. So we're going to go do the rest of what's on poly now and try to keep that as flat as possible. And then we're going to walk it <clears throat> back up in here and just try to cover up that stone just by hand floating it out. That's That's all we're going to do here and then... You know, that's what he's going to have in his basement. That's basically, we've <coughs> done 
hundreds of these like this down on the coast. There's a lot of rock on the main coastline, so a lot of basements down here have this ledge in it. Ready when you are, Scott? Yeah, we gotta keep that hole open somehow. Either we just carve it down or I build a box. Yeah, I, my son's going to get the keys. We gotta, we'll make a box for you. Oh, okay. That'd be great. Appreciate yeah. it. And we can keep that nice and flat right there. So. You guys are gonna try to fill in at the main he doesn't have nothing to do with it other than he's working for us. Oh. But yeah, we're going to try to, once we get this flat part done, we're going to go up and try to cover that stone. But we're just going to use the hand float and just float it out the best we can. Yeah. Up here, we're not going to do anything. Yeah. It wouldn't stay anyway. So we'll try to get that. It ain't going to be much more level than it is right now. There's one little place you got for a post. We'll mm -hmm. try to keep that level. So when you okay. set your post, it's not on something yeah. like that. Chances are we'll probably have to drill in and pin it anyway. So right. He's got uh, six by six PT. So. I should be able to mag that fairly flat right where that rebar is. Look at him. Almost there. I shouldn't have pulled all that out. I know you were thinking about yesterday, saying, yeah, you just kept on pulling it all out of it. <laughs> Good exercise. Yeah, I'll be out Right there. At least we're in the shade. Isaac Newton did not invent the cookies. They invented the cookie cutter. Cookie cutter. So this over here we'll just get a bunch of this thing. So that rock comes right up above yep. where we need to be. He's building the box right now. So we could uh, we could go up there and just pump out a little bit out until he gets that box. Did you want to get any down in there or no? Yeah, hold up, uh, Give him a little bit right here, Scott. Yeah, right where that thing is, try to keep it flat. Yeah, I take two by right out. I just left it so they knew where the lolly column pad was. You guys knew that. Pull it right out, yeah. Never say can't. Never say can't, right, Scott? Uh, you could just wipe it if you wanted. You don't have to power trowel it. Get it smooth. 
Yeah, maybe that end might be easier. Yep. We take one every corner. Yeah. There's more to it. Todd's magging your way backwards over there. Is your feet killing you? Your toes no, it's just your toes are crammed in the end of your boots. Yeah, it's just hard. Then you gotta fill all your boot prints. Yeah, so that's the best we do over the top of that ledge is we just get whatever flat area we can get. Give him something to work on maybe. He's got a stick of lolly column post right there where he kept that little spot perfectly flat. And that's how we get this done, so just stay here and we'll power trial this. We'll cut some saw cuts in it today and that'll be it for us today here. We'll be all done. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you on the next one.